Ah, yes. And we got a pike. Oh, it's a big one. Ah, it's a big pike. Nice. Oh, it's a big size pike. Come on. Wow. What a beauty. Don't let it go. Don't let it go. Oh, wow. What a gorgeous pike. Ah, I lost it. I lost this big pike. Shit. Oh, that was a big size pike. I just lost a huge pike. Oh, no. What a bummer. Definitely some pressure. Let's try again. I cast it twice. I got two bites so far. So it's just a matter of uh, setting the hook. Let's see what happens. I can see them trying to, to hit it, but they're too small. Should have maybe changed to a, a smaller lure, which I might just do. Well, they're quite active. They're feeding. Is great. Oh, and I got one. Yes. There we go. There we go. There we go. And there we go. Number one. That didn't take long. I got him on the gear plate. All right. Don't pinch me here. All right. All right. All right. How are you hooked? Okay. Hook went quite deep. Oh. It's a nice little perch for the start of the day. And it's really nice to fish them on such nice tackle because you can really feel the bite. I'm gonna let this guy go now. All right, one, two, three. Come get your mother, brother, sister, something bigger. All right, that was quite a quick catch. Off to the next one. And I'm fishing here on um, the Salmo Mino dice color, which is probably my best catcher when it comes to perch. So I'm just gonna keep on doing that because it proved to be quite good so far. Let's carry on. It's funny because when you uh, when you feel with light tackle like this, it really feels like you're actually going to use the, it really feels like you might want to use the net because the, every fish just feels so much bigger. But that's the beauty of having a uh, light tackle. So, any other takers here? Would be nice to have a bigger perch, of course, but the idea of light tackle is that you can enjoy also fishing for smaller ones. And there's another one too. That didn't take long. There's number two. Oh, there we are. So, probably from the same school of fish. It's not the same fish. I can see that clearly. Nice, nicely hooked. Give it back. And here's number two. Again, we're not talking about giants here. That's a small little one to start the deck. Opa! <laughs> That's a good catch. Slippery bastard. All right, he wants to go. I just want to take a quick little photo with him. Come on. One, two, three. And. I think it's time to let him go now. Goodbye. Still all small, but it's a very good start of the day. Maybe the old pike will give it a bite as well as it happens sometimes. I gotta tell you, I'm also not so used to fish on the uh, spinning reel anymore. I've been doing so much bait casting lately. It's fun to go back on a spinning reel. It's been a while.
Oh, here's the old bike, I promised you. I'm on a very, very light, thin, 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 thin uh, trace. So we need to get him back before he breaks me off and takes my lure away. I'm not gonna let him do that. Come on, little Jack. Come on here. I'm gonna tighten it a little bit. The drag. I don't want him to break me off because I want the lure back. And I don't want to break it. So, come on. You look tight enough to me. It's nice on the light tackle though. We need to get him back. Come on. Come on. There you are. I think you're ready for it. Get in the net. Get in the net. All right. He's in the net. Good thing. Hmm. Nice little jack. Let's release him real quick. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. I think he's already got himself released, didn't you? Damn, this little bag is feisty. Slippery as hell. All right, I'm gonna release him real quick. Photo of this little one, little Jack, who didn't want to take a photo, but has to. Slippery as hell. Well, he made his run. Goodbye, Pike. Off he goes. The old Pike of the day. As I, as I promised. Did I promise you a Pike or didn't I? There we go.